Hi guys, it's R and Jay. And we are headed on a little road trip down to Houston. What takes us about like three and a half hours to get out here? Yeah, close to four. Yeah, we're going to, we're going to go visit Jason's family. Got some family out in Conroe. But on the way, we figure since the Goodwills are open here in Texas, that we are going to stop at a few. So I think we're stopping in Katy first. Yeah, we are. <laughs> so come along with us. Alright, so that first Goodwill we went into, it was closed, and we were heading to a family thrift, and we saw this place. And this, this one's also closed. Does it say closed? Well, it looks like they're open. So I guess when in Houston, let's check out Family Thrift. Maybe we'll run into who? Mr. Cantu. Yes. Let's do this, come on. Hey babe, we're popping cherries here. Popping cherries? Yeah, over here at Family Thrift. Let's see if this thing's open. Bringing a mask in case they are mandatory here. It's our first time here. Family Thrift Center. Let's see if this place is open. So we've made it out to Conroe, where Jason's family lives, and we're checking out the local Conroe Goodwill. Number two. Yeah, how you be feeling about this? Feeling pretty good, let's go in there. <laughs> Well, we've been into two thrift stores so far out here in the Houston area. Two. <laughs> and I say we got some good pickups. We got some! We got some stuff. Condro, Condro loves us. Con who's Condro? Alejandro? No. No, Conroe. Conroe, Texas, man. Conroe pet. And we're out. We're, we're going to go home. We're going home. And, oh, we're not done yet? Are you drinking? I'm thinking about it. Oh. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Are we done? Are you not saying anything? <laughs> hey, so we stopped in this Goodwill. What did I just say? I don't know, but we I think we look cute together. Yeah, we stopped in this Goodwill and we checked it out. And at first, we didn't think we were going to find anything. We found some hookahs. Oni Onis. They were all jacked up. Found some uh, wannabe LeBron that uh, jacked up. But man, I turned the corner, I found some ultras, man. They're pretty legit. We'll show you in a bit. But then we also came across some Uggs. Uh, didn't know if they were real or not, and they were pretty pricey, so we left them inside. So if y'all want to come back here to Conroe, Texas, y'all are more than welcome to. But then we also picked up some... Keens. Keens, some kid Keens. Some ke ke yeah. Keen sandals. Yeah, for like three bills, man. They're like nothing, like, oh, I'm not 300 three dollars man it's pretty cheap and we picked up some other goodies and we'll show you all those but you know what we got some chicken waiting at the house my mom's is burning some chicken and we're gonna go home and eat so burning some chicken i hope not Ooh. hey but that's what that alcohol is gonna help for i mean those uh sugar water let's go all right well i don't remember which ones we got where but here's what we got today today we got some 
Grand OS's and these are actually Grand Pro Cole Haan OS's and they're runners and you can actually tell and I'm gonna take the sticky off so you don't see the prize but you can tell that they haven't even really been worn. Took these out for a quick jog and then dropped them off at the Goodwill. Then we also picked up these uh, Saucony Excursions, Excursion TR6s. A little harder to see, but it's right there on the tongue. Got a pretty cool little colorway. You can see those. Here, let's see if I can get the tongue out. Hello. Hello. These are pretty cool. Don't look like they've really been worn very much either. And then we also have these Ultras. Pretty really sick colorway. It's gotten like a purple or maybe raspberry. I think I looked it up and think it said raspberry. Pretty nice. And these are the Torin 2.5s. 2.5s? Yeah. Torin 2.5s. You can tell these bad boys have not been worn very much either. And then we have some Shimano's. Got the Shimano's. A little mountain bike action. So Eclipse, size 43's. Pretty nice shoe. Don't look like they've been worn very much either. Got some Echoes. Little boots. You can see that they're Echoes right there on the side. Boom. Don't look like they've been worn very much either. Everybody's taking little jogs or one out and then just dropped them off with the Goodwill and Thrift. Everybody's in the moment of giving and taking care of people. And then my partner in crime found these. Right, R? Yeah. Bussalo? Yeah, I think that's what it's called. We haven't seen this type of shoe before. And I hope I'm holding it right side up so that you yeah. can see. And this is, what, is this, what do you call this version? Like a Mary Jane? Yeah. Mary Jane, because it's got like the, the strap and these are strap with a hook and loop as we've been yeah it's told. like a Mary Jane style comfort shoe did you see what it says on the inside it says something about like antibacterial something <laughs> oh no I didn't see that what no on the oh, maybe it's on the insole huh it's on the insole nope no I know but I'm saying I don't see it in there oh I think he needs to get his eyes checked yeah, no I, I saw it but I didn't see that little I don't think we'd be able to see it it's, it's, it's ultra tiny can you see it Anyway, it's in there. That's what she's talking about. And I was like, I thought that was just a little, little bit more information about the shoe. But ultimately, we did find out something about this, too. You, when you post on eBay, you can't say Velcro. It says hook and loop. So that's something new. So we just learned that. Um, I think we learned that from, what was it, Part-Time Pickers, right? Mm -hmm. Part-Time Pickers. I don't know where he's out of, but we watched a couple of his videos. So if I you think check he's him in out, California. Is he California? I think so. Yeah. And he says you have to be really careful because I didn't know too, like if you post the wrong things or don't post something right, they can actually uh, restrict you. And sometimes it could be uh, two or three days restricted and you won't actually get any sales. And then here we have these uh, shape, uh, sketcher shape ups. You can see the shape ups. And once again, these bad boys don't look like they've been worn very much either. Got some good laces. Oh, they smell very good. No, I'm just kidding. Uh, but, but otherwise, you know, they shape you up. They give you a little, Give you a little run. Toning maybe. action. Yeah, and then we got these uh, Keens. I'm going to cover up the tag. Some Keen water shoes, hiking. Why are you going to cover up the tag? Because that's what I just did. I covered Okay, here's the tag. Y'all want to see the tag? Tag, tag. You're it. Gotcha. <laughs> so we won't have to do too much, but there's some little stragglers. Just, that you just I mean, to bas cut. basically, we're just going to have to give these little guys a bath and post them on eBay and, and turn a little profit. And we actually have a bowl, which we're going to show you tomorrow because. We're going back out tomorrow. We're going to find some good places. Talk to my brother and my sister. They've told us some really good locations, and hopefully they're open. I know we're going to hit up the Woodlands, and I think it's called Cypress, Cypress Wood, and then Loretta, somewhere off of Loretta, and they have some weird name, uh, street name called oh. Kirk, Kirkendall or something like that. So we're going to hit up Kirkendall. I don't know that we'll make it into Houston because we're about 45 minutes to an hour out, and we wanted to visit a little bit of family. But So we hit two stores, and we hit about – five five pairs each so we were really being picky on what we found um and ultimately uh spent about 60 bucks so the average sale price or the average cost of goods is going to be about seven dollars and um then we did comps on all these so we uh, should turn around and turn a profit of about 250 and sell them for about 300 bucks so it's pretty legit so wish us luck we'll see you next time here on 
Adventures with RJ. Because I always forget my own channel. No, just kidding. I just like to have her interact a little bit. Just just a smidge, just a scotch. 